Over the 4th of July weekend, I thought it would be appropriate to do a little American history quiz for some area millennials. I'm Addie Ippinson with The Morning Meeting, and this past week I headed west to see what the people at Tom Sawyer Days in Hannibal, Missouri really know about the American holiday. What are we celebrating on the 4th of July? What's the point of 4th of July? Independence from Britain. Uh, we got our uh, freedom from Britain. It's Independence Day. What are we celebrating this 4th of July? What's the point? Like, so the country. <laughs> How about our independence? So what year did we win our independence? 1776. Did you say 1492? I, I was throwing out dates. I was going to go from bottom to the top, you know. What year did we declare our independence? 1776. 18... 50 something? Lower. 1830? Lower. 1820? Try 1700s. 1700s, oh my god. What, what number in 1700s though? All right, so say like the 1760s. Closer, 1776. In what city was the declaration signed? Boston. Say it one more time with confidence. There you go. In what city was the declaration signed? Um, Starts with a P. Pennsylvania. Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Philadelphia. Who was the general that led us during the Revolutionary War? That was George Washington. George Washington. No, what are you doing? Who was the general that led us during the Revolutionary War? What was his name? Uh, who was our first president? And who was the king that we defeated? Oh, we learned this last year. Come on. Uh, king. Starts with a G. My king. Who was the king we overruled? I know it's king Henry. I know it's not that. But I, don't, I know it's not that. What king did we defeat? Henry. What king did we defeat? What was his name? King George III. The answers I collected weren't quite as disappointing as I expected, which is great, but I still encourage all millennials to read a history book every once in a while. I'm Addie Ippinson for The Morning Meeting.